Forests of the Caspian Green Belt, one of the oldest ecosystems on the surface of the Earth. This explosion of green has been reflecting its mesmerizing beauty for thousands of years. This is a small part of the Hyrcanian forest that has continued to thrive for millions of years. Scientists say that the ancestors of these trees came to existence more than 40 million years ago, and today the southern coasts of the Caspian Sea are heir to this ecological heritage. In a country where more than 90% of the land is dominated by deserts and rugged mountains, this picturesque thin line of the northern side of the Alberz mountain range in Iran's north is more like a dream than reality. However, parts of this amazing green belt is covered by mystery, at a place where nature subtly changes its direction and gives way to its frightening side to appear. In our series of programs in Mazandaran province, we heard about a place which, according to the locals, is very spooky. And that place is situated somewhere in the heights of Sisangan Mountains in Noshah County. In fact, the locals believe that that place is haunted. So once again, our curiosity took us to a place rarely visited by the people to find out whether there is any kind of weird phenomenon or anything strange going on in that place or not. حدوداً 35 تا 40 کیلومتر از نوشهر فاصله داره راه دسترسیش تقریبا میشه گفت یه راه خطرناک یه مقدار سخت با توجه به اینکه باطلاقیه نمیشه داخل دریاچه را To tell you the truth at first sight I felt that spine chilling wave passing right through my body as I stepped into the place and what was expecting me out there the ghost lake here trees have grown differently. The strange and hallucinating shape of their branches, the rugged terrain which leads to the area, and the occasional sound of wild animals and petrified wood breaking off the trees may be reasons behind naming the place as the ghost lake by the locals. Whether this place is haunted or not, the atmosphere is quite scary enough to make you believe there is something weird about this place. There is something in the air which says, don't go any further, there's fear and danger ahead. Even this fella seemed to want to discourage us from going any further by just saying, <coughs> Despite all the anxiety that was worsened by a bumpy road, we were finally there. Welcome to the Ghost Lake. This large pit was once a hollow part of the forest where many trees used to grow, but as time passed, rainwater slowly filled it to form a basin. The trees in the pit gradually suffocated as a result. Once the inhabitants of the forest, these dead trees are like ghosts wandering on the water surface. <laughs> چیزی ندیدن از ارواح و یا مثلا امثال این چیزا ولی شاید سرصدای حیوانات وحشی باعث شده که چون ترسناک بوده اینا فکر کنن که اونجا یک روحیه یک ارواحیه ولی چیزی رو کسی ندیده بر اساس باورهای گذشته این دریاچه رو به نام دریاچه ارواح نامگذاری کرده I asked one of the locals in the area whether ghosts at the lake were for real or they're just an illusion. The trees reflecting themselves on the still surface of the water add more excitement to this daunting atmosphere. Well, I must confess that it does feel kind of scary here. And there may be some temptations to spend the night out here by the fire and inside a tent. But no, that is something I don't want to do. I'd rather spend the night at home. But still, there are lots of things to enjoy here, such as the beautiful weather, wonderful landscapes, a hot cup of tea by the fire, and of course, a bunch of good friends. I'm your Mehdi Kazemi for Iran.